Biters. Welcome back to another episode of Yummy Bites TV. Y'all, today we have Mambo Seafood. Mambo Seafood. I'm excited. Yes, y'all. So we have, um, this supposed to be peel and eat shrimp, but we asked them to devein it, so they just took the whole peeling off. And these are called Mambo Saute Shrimp, y'all. We have fried shrimp. We have fried fish, we have crispy fried wings, and shrimp fried rice with dipping sauce. And we have these mango drinks, y'all, with like that spicy seasoning on top. What? Yeah, that's what it looks like. So you gotta stir it up, huh? No, you're not supposed to stir it up, you're just supposed to drink it like that. It's like that, um. Where's my straw? What you did with my straw? It's like that, uh. What? Lucas? Yes, yeah. exactly. The kids had this before, y'all. So we trying it now. Okay. All right. You ready? Let's do it. Lord, please bless this food in God's name. Amen. Lord, hear our prayers. All right, y'all. Y'all ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? All right. Oh, we need to take a thumbnail. Can you take a thumbnail? Come on, let's just, let's try one. Mm. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> mm. They're all right. They yeah. got a lot of salt on them, huh? Pepper. Yeah, it is spicy. Not even close to as good as what that one place? Ooh. What's that one place where I had, they gave me one that was like hotter than what we had asked for? Mm. You remember Seven that? Seven spice. Yeah. Yeah. Bro. We're going to be back over there. Trust me. I expect this there. to be better than Seven Spice. I mean, it's good, though. It's daggone good. Look at that, y'all. Who wants a yummy bite of this delicious? It's spicy. Yes, Lord. It's spicy. Mmm. What they get you to eat with this? You supposed to eat it with the rice or something? Uh huh. Mmm. When I tell you that place is always packed, y'all. Good rice. They're they're known for their rice. It is always packed. I don't care when you go. This wine look extra crunchy. Do I have? Look at that. Don't look crunchy. I was like, dang. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Yum. I'm going to use this sauce that they gave me. It's like a rumelad sauce, y'all. That they gave me to dip the chicken wings in. They're not that seasoned, but they hella crunchy. <laughs> Your no, sauce is seasoned. No. That, that wing is not seasoned. This batter is seasoned to me. Mm -mm. Yes. It ain't even got no Difference salt of in opinion, y'all. It ain't even it's got seasoned no salt to me. in it. Yeah, that's that sauce, baby, I'm trying to tell you. Mm-mm. Mm. What? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This tastes like the candy. Y'all ever had the Spanish candy with the, you know, it'd be like a sucker. Yeah. And then it got the, 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 the what, well, this exactly how this tastes. I love that flavor. Sweet and salty and spicy all at the same time mm -hmm. with the um, chili powder. Mm. Oh, man, what they call this? 
I think it's called a mambo chilada. Man. No. Mango chilada. If y'all ain't ever had some spicy Mexican candy, you need to get you some. I'm trying to tell you. Man, I would have never thought the drink would have tasted like that. Mm-hmm. Happy Friday up in this piece, y'all. So glad it's the weekend. So glad. what it really looked like. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Delicious, y'all. This is fish. They told me what kind of fish this was, but I could not understand them at all. I know it's not tilapia or, or um, or, um, what do you call it? Catfish. Smell good. They can make it crispier. I like it though. Nice and delicate. Mm hmm Flaky. And thin. Mmm. I like the sauce that they use. Um, all, they have like big chunks of garlic. And I don't know what kind of other seasons these are, but. Mm. So what are y'all doing this weekend? Y'all have so many videos playing like, it's been so exciting thinking of stuff to eat, y'all. <laughs> we were supposed to do pizza party Friday today, y'all. But I changed my mind. I wanted something on the lighter side, so we're going to do pizza party Friday probably tomorrow. Right? Mm. <sighs> yeah, them joke was hot. My you are wet. The drink can't even wash the pepper out. Yeah. Oh my god, it's not that hot. Yeah, it is. Mm -mm. Y'all, it's not. <clears throat> so good. Full of spice. First, my first taste of it, I thought it was too salty, but it's not. These rolls remind me of Timmy Chan. <laughs> mm. I like the wings. Do you? Mm hmm. I got enough seasoning for me. But you got too much seasoning. Yeah, too much <laughs> here and not enough. I like my seafood like that though. Mm. I like that these are crunchy. Yeah, I like the flavor. So who going to um, a TSU and PB game this weekend? I wish I could go. I mean, I wish I wanted to go. <laughs> you wish you wanted to go? Mm -hmm. I mean, I kind of want to go, but then again, I don't, you know? But what makes you want to go to that? 
I went to TSU, hello. <laughs> I used to go all the time. It's just nice to see your colleagues, you know, people you used to go to school with, the band, you know, the marching band when they do the halftime show. And then they're doing a uh, battle of the bands. You know, that's always exciting. People always come back to those types of games. Like our rivals. Who was y'all's rival? At, um, what was it, Magnese? Girl, I was never, I'm not a part of them. So you, so you didn't, you didn't know who y'all's rival school was? I just went was? to school, bro. Like, seriously, I care about, are you serious? Yeah. The only school I was ever a part, like, my neighborhood school, like, which got shut down. I ain't, I don't, when I go to somewhere, I'm not a part of them. Like, just, you know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Like, I, I wasn't a, please. <laughs> I have zero school pride whatsoever. Oh, okay. At all. Gotcha. I have school pride. <laughs> who else got school pride? Let me know who your alma mater is in the comments. We would go to the game, and if it was a game at our school, mm. we'd go to the other side. We wanted to go be seen by the other people that, you know what I'm saying? You must have had a wax school. Like, why would you want to do that? <laughs> yeah, I didn't go to, uh, it wasn't a lit school. Mm. <clears throat> That's unfortunate. But even if it was though, like, you know, you want to be seen and mingle with the outsiders. To us, that you know what I'm saying? We want to go pull something from somewhere else. Oh my god. Ain't nobody even talking about that. That's why we went to the games. It was all about being seen, pulling something, just reputation, just, you know, oh my god, did you see so and so? You know, we had to be there. We had to be there. I didn't care one bit about the game. We didn't pay attention to the game. Well, we didn't care about the game either. We cared about halftime, basically. That's what we were there we for. We would never even sit down and look at the game. We would constantly just roam we around. We wouldn't either. Because I wasn't a football girl. Like, I, I've i never been into football ever. But did go to the games for the halftime show. Hello. That's what people go to the um, Super Bowl for, really. You think people go to well, the Super Bowl for the do. halftime show? A lot of people do. <laughs> it's true. And other reasons, of course, but. If there was no halftime show, I don't think half them people would be there. I'm trying to tell you, the halftime show is what brings the people in. Am I wrong, y'all? I people like the halftime, but people ain't gonna sit through no long, uh, boring game just for no halftime show. They will. I'm trying to throw you. That's the blittest part of the game, is the halftime show. Yes, Lloyd. What? I can't believe this is too hot for you. Yeah. Straight up. Now, I highly recommend y'all try these from Bombo Seafood. They have plenty of locations. They actually gave me the menu. They have lots of locations in Houston, y'all. They got locations in Baytown. Where else? Google it, y'all. Mambo Seafood. How you spell it? M A M B O. I was trolling. Mambo. You what? I was trolling. If somebody can't spell Mambo, I'm sorry. <laughs> Woo wee! Boy. That's, they got an ingredient in here I don't like. I don't know what it is. What? It's like some type of flavor that's standing out. I don't like it. It's big chunks of garlic. I don't even know if that's the type of flavor. <clears throat> so eating them without the shell, uh, shell, do they taste any different? Or they taste the same? They actually, to me, taste different. I actually like them better with the shell. Like, you know how like you, um, you get the strip and then you suck it with the shell on and then you peel it? I liked it better like that. But you wanted them to devein them. 
You didn't? I didn't care. I had them without him being D-Bane before. You didn't care. You even told me if you can't get him D-Bane, you wouldn't even gonna get him. Because you. Because of me. Yes. You're totally fine with eating shrimp that ain't been D-Bane. I told you I already had D-Shrimp. I know, but without in the future, you would have been cool to sit here and eat some shrimp yes. that haven't been D-Bane. I did it already. I had already done it. I thought you did it and you just didn't realize it until the end. And you mm -hmm. was like, oh, well, I already did it. I realized it when I first had saw him. I was like, dang, he's not uh, D Vane, but oh well. Yeah, I don't do D un D Vane. That's just disgusting. And then you could do it yourself. You could just take it out yourself. Yeah, not when I'm eating. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm mean? saying? Yeah, I get that. But. Yeah, I like them better with the show on. Um. Mmm, but this damn drink is outstanding. Mmm. This must be fresh puree mango up in here with this ice, huh? Probably. Why somebody else came out? And said, you know that girl, um, that do the trap tutorials? And said, basically, she got it from her. She was doing it way before her. <laughs> way before her. She was like, she got the inspiration from me. This girl named Bree Hall. I was like, what? And she showed the footage. I was like, what? Yeah. So everybody copying at the end of the day, copying somebody. So, I think that's where it ended, though. But yeah, she said, um, I was doing this back in, you know, it was before her. And she's smaller than her. I'm gonna tell um, you. No. It's well, like the food chain, a, a little bit bigger fish. Oh, no, I know. I think they're, in, they're, they're about the same. Really? Yeah. They might be about the same, but Brie Hall has a YouTube channel, and the other girl doesn't. Mm. She does the Instagram thing. So one was doing it on YouTube, the other one started doing it on Instagram. Uh huh. But she really put her own twist to it, though, because it's still not the same. But you can you can tell that you know she probably drew inspiration from her. Uh -huh. Possibly, who knows? But um, anyway. So what did you think? Obviously, you didn't like any of it. Did you like any of it? The rice is banging. Chicken got an excellent crunch on it, just no seasoning. Uh, you know, the seafood kind of bland too, really no seasoning with it. Okay. Uh, and the shrimp just a little too spicy for my taste. You know. But somebody else might love it. Well, I do. I love the shrimp. Y'all need to try the shrimp. It's called Mambo Shrimp. It's sauteed shrimp. And this like garlicky sauce that they have. Um, Relax. The fried fish was all right. I wish it was crispier. I like the fried wings. The um, shrimp fried rice was good. Um, did I even taste the shrimp? Hey, this shrimp could be crunchier too. But I need to work on that crunch game. <laughs> they got a crunch game when you come to this right on here. Them, on them they wings. need to do these like that. Yeah. And throw some salt and pepper in there. They're not gonna hurt, man. <laughs> <laughs> so at least some salt and black pepper. At least. I love when they give you the sweet roll. It's so good. And this drink and this rice excellent. Yeah. Even though the little shrimp wasn't divine, you know. Hey. <sighs> If you don't like, if you like stuff, shrimp that's not D-Vein, it's probably the place for you. <laughs> mm. mm. Y'all was trying to do this video before Jayden came home. And we did it. Yeah. That's why y'all hear no laughing. <laughs> 
It made me so happy that he be that happy. Yeah, I know. Yeah. I know. Having a good old time, too. <laughs> All right, that's enough eating. But well, you got your appetite back, haven't you? You eat more than me now. Oh, yeah. I just hope to God. <laughs> I don't blow up, like, really, really fast. I'm already gaining weight, y'all. It's all good. I need to gain a little bit of weight, honestly. You got, Y'all got to get one of these. Yeah. It's sweet and uh, spicy at the same time. You never had nothing like that. I bet you. You want a shrimp, Papa? I'm gonna say this for Lele. I'm gonna get him the Bobby. Hmm? I'm gonna get him the Bobby. Mm -mm. Yes. He's trolling. Is that what that is? <laughs> <laughs> Shoot. Mm. Anyway, <clears throat> y'all let me know in the comments if you've ever tried Mambo Seafood, and if you did, what do you get off the menu? Bruh, let us know. What do we need to try? They have a lobster dish on there, though. We Looks need to really try good. Yeah, somebody else. Which <laughs> <laughs> we need to keep it moving around. Yeah, I'm oh glad my I'm God! It's the last, first and the last. Y'all give us some suggestions, please. Anyway, I hope that y'all enjoy this video. Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram at Yummy Bites TV and my family vlog channel at Yummy Bites TV Behind the Scenes. And I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, please do what? Thumbs up this video. Subscribe if you haven't already <laughs> for everyday videos. Everyday videos. And we will see you guys on tomorrow. Peace. And y'all come back now. You hear? Mmm. Delicious. <laughs>